I guess I should plug my air in and take my barrel cover off. Uh, queen. Queen to the hill. How many times do I have to shoot you? Pull it! I trust you first. You need to go respawn. How many times do I have to shoot you? I trust you first, you need to go respawn. Okay, let me break something down about this clip here. First push. I light this guy up and he refuses to call the first, it, what I count is at least 7 to 10 shots. He didn't call him and I leaned out and he left his leg exposed on the other side of the box. I leaned out and shot him in the leg at least 3 more times. And then I'm, I'm deciding like I'm not going to let this guy just get away with this. So I decide to charge him and I go after him and of course, you know, I thought it, for sure I was just gonna, he was going to call it this time. But no! So I run up on him, and I get there, and we run up, and we shoot each other. And you might see what looks like some BBs bouncing off of me. But that was because, like, I think, I don't know, I didn't feel those, but, I mean, he shot me. Once I got to the actual wall, he had shot me, and I called it. Probably shouldn't have, but I did, because that's, I'm being the better person. So I shoot him. He puts his hand up, whether or not he was putting it up as, like, saying he was going to call it, or, like, in annoyance that I would rush him. But this guy is, like, I've seen this guy. This guy is, like, 30 to 40 years old, and he cheats like this. So after I, walk, I start to walk back, I see that he put his hand up and then put it back down and then kept shooting. So I was like, like, what do you do? I was like, I shot you first. You need to go respawn. I shot you first. You need to go respawn. Like, I, was, I didn't, like, go and get in his face and stuff. I just told him, like, you need, you need to call that. Like, like, what's the matter with you? And he has the audacity to tell me. He was like, I'm pretty sure that was a mutual exchange, buddy. That's you first. You need to go respawn. I'm like, it probably would have been if me coming around the side of that box had, was the only thing that happened. But no. I was like, I put at least 30 shots into you before that. Like, directly before that. And the only reason I had to rush you is because you didn't call it. So I don't know what this guy's issue was. I don't know. Maybe he feels like he has to cheat in order to be good. But, I mean, I don't have to cheat in order to be eh, okay at Airsoft. I'm not the best at Airsoft. Don't get me wrong. Because, uh, I mean, I'm not, I'm not that good. And I'm fat. So, you know. Anyway, I just felt like I had to expose this guy. I ended up showing most of the other players that were there that day the clip, and we all ended up laughing and pointing at the guy. But I didn't bother to show the refs, although I probably should have. But too much time has passed now for me to do anything about it, although this guy has been there pretty regularly, and I'm going to uh, play Airsoft. I recorded this on Tuesday, so this is probably... Yeah, I'm going to play on Tuesday. So, anyway, thanks for watching my low-budget videos, all you subscribers. Peace out. Merry Christmas.